Hi guys, hi fans. How are you guys today? You are welcome to our channel today. It's a girl Chinasuke, go from Africa, the very pretty girl from the city of Owere. Guys, you are welcome to our channel today. Yeah, on today's video, guys, we're going to be talking about irresistible qualities of an African man. Those qualities that make our African man charming, make them irresistible, make them Mm. <laughs> yeah, make them the most wanted when it has to do with dating relationship. African men are hot, they are the most wanted, they are on top, they are irresistible. So, Ibo now, Ibo base, no, see, African guys. Mm. They are they are something else. Our African men are talking of they are irresistible when it has to do with dating. Oh 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 hey every babe out there wants African man. Seriously, we are supposed to title this video those uh, maybe few qualities that make African man irresistible or charming to Western ladies. But no, it's not only the Western Western ladies that want an African man. African girls, African ladies, we also want crepe hunts for our men because mm, they are everything you need to have in a relationship. They are everything you need to have as a woman. Yeah, African men, they are on point. So we're going to be talking about those things, those qualities that makes them hot, that make them Mm, that make us dream about them, that make us crave for them, that make us hurt for them. Yeah. Okay. So if this is the type of video you want to watch, please get a glass of water or juice or something chewable and chill wherever you are. Pay attention so that you get every gist, every point we are about to make on this video. I love you guys. Just do well to share this video. Write your comment down below. Like this video. And do well to subscribe. Yeah. <laughs> For those of you who have not subscribed to our channel, please, we are begging you. Do well to hit that subscribe button. It's totally free. And then share our post. Yeah, guys. Going straight to the point number one irresistible quality of an african man when it has to do with relationship is one african man knows how to take care of himself hmm. african man know how to take care of himself look good look snatch package himself we are the are uh, we are the latest designers dress well he know how to combo he know how to do mix combination of the cloth that he would hear and he will look so cute yeah he know how to cut his hair the hairstyle that is suitable for him he knows the right perfume to put on or to wear at the right time he knows where he look good he smell nice he put on wristwatch he know the shoe to wear he take care of himself he spend time to take care of himself that's the first quality and when he is on point when he polish himself and he's looking good every eye every lady out there uh is actually looking her eyes are widely open to notice them to observe them to follow them to love them to date them and ready to settle them with them okay point number two number one we said that african man knows how to take care of himself and this number two is kind of related to number one point because Number two, African man knows how to take care of his lady. Hmm. African man knows how to take care of his lady. African man will want his woman's hair to be on point. He wants you as a girlfriend, as the woman in his life, to dress well. He wear the best clothes or combination of clothes. He, he wanted to your hair to be flicked, like to be on flicks to look good. He wants you to like you know touch yourself. He knows what you need to eat, you know what you need to wear, you know what you lack, you know what to give to you and what to give to you. Like 
African man knows how to take care of his woman. Yes. African man knows how to take care of his woman. Please, 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 for those of you who have been into a relationship with an African man, those of you who are experienced, quote me right or wrong in the comment section because some of you might think maybe I'm just praising them because I'm over praising my brothers because I'm an African lady. No, there are also foreign ladies out there who have dated African men. Please say your experience let us know your experience down the comment box okay number three reason why african men are charming irresistible they know what ladies want to hear and they know when to say it and they know how to say it they can tell us those sweet sweet words that we have been wanting we have like anyone else have not told us they know how to tell us sweet sweet things Colors, beautiful lady, my angel, my queen, you are the most pretty, you are the most lovely, you are the most darkest, you are the most charming. Oh, they can tell you, they can spoil you with their tongue. They have this, they know how to use their tongue to spoil a lady. They know how to use their tongue to make you feel on top, to make you feel like a queen, to make you feel like you are the most pretty lady, even when you are ugly like. <laughs> me <laughs> am i ugly i'm not ugly but when you are ugly and look how you know they know how to use their mouth to make you feel like queen elizabeth of england they make you feel like the queen of africa like yeah the queen of nigeria 2023 they make you how know how to look feel beautiful so they know how to use their tongue That's Number four, African man know how to pamper this woman. He knows how to pet his woman. He knows how to pamper your, his woman. He knows how to take care of the woman. He knows how when to support, you know when to. Hey, they will spoil you with petting. If you come with pet names, African man is there to call you with petting. Pet, with pet names. If it comes with pet treat, African man knows how to pet you and treat you like a baby and treat you like a queen. They know how to feed you with food, with spoon. They can feed you with their hand, bare hand. They can feed you drink. They know how to take care of you. They know how to clean your face with their hanky when you're sweating. They know how to like, they know how to. Hola, African lady knows how, African guys know how to pamper a lady to spoil. They will spoil you with pampering, with petting. They pet you, they carry you, they care for you like you are just a baby of human. Mm, who doesn't like that? Who wouldn't like that? I know, I know that's why you're dying for that African man. That's why you don't want to live here and that's why you don't want to let him. Hey, my brothers can pamper a woman. Hey, they can pamper a woman like a baby. You know how you know how baby feel when you carry them in their hand and you are sending them to sleep, you are sending them to bed, you are petting them to sleep. That is exactly how African man pets his woman. They carry the baby, they carry you, my baby, my baby, my queen, my this, my angel. They don't want you to. You carry like breakable plate. Hmm. <laughs> they care for you like you're a breakable plate. <laughs> they don't want you to do anything strong. They don't want you to do anything hard. They don't want you to say anything hard. They don't want you to do anything. They can even grant food. What? They can even grant food for you so as for you not to stress yourself. They will treat you in such a way you will live a stressless life. You won't be stressed at, at all. They won't want to stress you in any way. They will pay to pamper you, care for you like a baby. Alright? So, this other point I have here is making me to feel like it's getting to my body. You see, African men know where to touch a lady to turn him on. They touch you here. They know how to touch you here. They know how to touch you here. They know how to touch you here. <laughs> They tickle you like this, they touch your back, they touch your bum, they touch your... Hey, African men know how to touch, 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 touch and where to touch and when to touch you to make you on, to turn you on. African men know how to turn a lady on. 
by touching. They can spark their bones. They can touch, give them a slight touch at the bone. They can give you a slight touch at the back, at the cheeks, uh, okay, at your ribs, at the cheeks. They know how to pet. They know how to peck you. They know when to peck you. They know where to. Oh, the African man can even use only touch on your palm or your finger to turn you on. They know how to do it gently. They know how to smooth. Do it to like put you in the mood. You can't stay with an African man and say you're not in the mood. Unless you're faking, unless you're pretending, unless you're forcing yourself. You can't tell me you will stay with an African man. I say, babe, you are not in the mood. He will put you in the mood. What mood are you not moody? African man knows how to put you in the mood even when, to, when you don't want to be in the mood. Only a touch on your palm can turn you on. It can you know where to touch you. He touch you here, he touch you here, he touch you here, he touch you here, touch you here. Everywhere is touchable. When he start giving you a dental touch in any part of his uh, any part of your body, he's concentrating, gently touching it, touching it consistently. One you go on now. You go on. <laughs> Do you need electric power? Electric power supply to be on. You must all know. African man know how to own a woman, turn a woman on, you know, put you in that mood that you don't want to mood. And you'll be mooding the mood. <laughs> oh, when an African man decides to touch you, when an African man decides to spoil you with touch, hey, the gentleness, how smooth, how calm he will be touching you slowly and slowly. One day, you will be in the mood. Whether you want to move the mood, you will move the mood. You get that? They know how to do it. They know how to do it on your system. It can only be touching your shoulder. Only your shoulder, a shoulder touch can turn a woman on. Mm. They will give you gentle touch, gentle massage on your shoulder before you know you will feel like sleeping in their arm, before you know you feel like, oh, they will take you to heaven while you are still on earth. So African men are good in touching the woman and that is irresistible. Yeah, number, 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 number. African number. men knows how to gift a woman. Yeah, African men, they know how to gift a woman. They know how to spoil a woman with gift. If African man is buoyant enough, eh, he will kill. He will kill. He will nearly kill you with gifts. He will get surprises for you on daily basis. He keep getting expensive gifts for you, even when they are not born until they have little. No matter how their their level of their income, they will try as much as they can to always be gifting you. Even with small, small gifts, the way they were going to be surprising you with it, even if it's a more expensive gift, the way they are going to be surprising you, choking you with gift, oh, you'll be forced to melt. You will melt. You're going nowhere because African man is ready to gift you. In as much as he can afford it, he can gift you. And that is why you see them hustling. African man hustle. And they hustle. I don't even know if they are hustling to please a woman because they are ready to spend. They are ready to spend for their woman. So they hustle and whatever the woman need, they are there to provide it. You get that? African man is a go-getter. They chase, they work, they hustle. They are not, they are busy always to, you know, they strive, they hustle to achieve. So as for them to use that resources, to make their woman comfortable because the african man already know that he has a responsibility he has someone looking up to him he has someone to care for he has a woman in his life so if he don't hustle and make money he cannot like take care of that woman the way he wants it or provide for that woman so imagine when a man is waking up in the morning to go and hustle with every seriousness to go and hustle to make you happy who wouldn't like that imagine as a queen a man is waking up on daily basis to go out there to hustle in order to make you happy who are oh celebrate keep celebrating if you have an african man in your life you are a celebrity a celebrity for him because he's gonna give you all your wants. yeah another quality we have here is that an african man know when to call or check on his woman 
He knows that he's going to call you in the... He knows that he's going to be the first person to wake you up in the morning to have to see how your night was. If you had a splendid night, he knows that he's going to call to ask you if you are set to work. He knows that he's going to go call you to check if you are done working for the day if you are back home he knows that he's going to call you if to know if you have taken your bath if you have eaten food or daily basis african man know when to call african man know how to call and check on his woman he can't be in his he can't be in your life and you feel lonely no because he know when to call you and he always call at the right time the point i have here is that african man is very very supporting African man support you in as much as they are in your life. If you have a new dream to chase, they are going to give you every support you need. They are going to support you like father is supporting a daughter to achieve a dream. If you, if an African man is in your life or you're dating an African man, maybe you are chasing a goal, you are still learning work, an African man is ready to, this is why an African man is ready to train a girl in the university, pay for all the uni requirements. An African man is ready to take you and sponsor your skill. Maybe you are still on that level where you are still figuring yourself or you are trying to learn a skill. An African man will give you all the support you need an African man will help you sponsor, an African man will help you secure a job, an African man will help you pursue your dream and career, an African man is just supportive, an African man is there to support you with whatever available within his reach. If it is taking you there, if it is by financing it, if it is by encouraging you, it is by advising you on what to do and how to achieve your dream and how to be progress and how to become a better person. An African man is going to do that and that is charming. It's so irresistible. You cannot want to lose a man who is, you know, trying to be a backup, trying to care for you like a father, trying to help you to achieve what you know that is a dream or a lifetime goal. No, now you cannot joke with You cannot lose him. You cannot afford to lose that African man. Child be too realistic to yourself yes he's going to support you to achieve your dream even to the extent he can extend this support to your entire family member whatever need that any member of your family is having if he is here if he's buoyant enough he can willingly support you to support your family because we are family oriented unless an African man doesn't have. If an African man is buoyant enough, you'll be surprised that he will cut up for your need, cut up for, cut up for your parents' need, cut up for your siblings' need. But if they don't have, they can actually give you the little support they think they can at the moment. Because if African man is loving you, he is loving your entire family. And he don't want you to be in pain and he don't want them to be in pain. Because any pain that affects them will affect you. So for you not to be in pain, for you not to worry, so you not to be in bother, for you not to be bothered, African man is willing and ready to you know, extend this support to your family. Yes, and that is why some ladies try to overdo. Some ladies try to overdo, making it their right, you know, for them to cater for their family need. You don't, don't, um, what I, what would I call, take advantage. Some ladies want to take advantage of that. So now, choke an African man to cater for their family no you don't need to you don't need to force this an african man if, an, if you have an african man in your life you don't even need to force him to bring out money to help your family if he's not helping you if he's not extending this uh, uh, support to the family believe me he don't have it african man will genuinely and willingly support your family support you to support your family if he is buoyant enough unless he don't have that money so some ladies are there are seeing them like they, they are not stupid this is how much we love family this is how much we care for family this is how much an african man care for family or african homes care for family and relatives we are family oriented so don't take it for stupidity don't take us don't see them like mumu they are not mumu they are just carrying out they are just showcasing lifestyle of an african home. another thing we have here is that an african man know how to appreciate his woman effort 
any little effort you make in that relationship, an African man knows how to appreciate it. And maybe you you cook for him, you wash for him, you do any normal duty of a woman. African man know when to say thank you. An African man know when to celebrate you. An African man know how to you know appreciate your effort, any little effort of a woman in a relationship. An African man is there to appreciate you, either by gifting you or by thanking you. Yeah, an African man know how to celebrate. Another point here is that an African man know how to celebrate his woman. He keep the important dates in your life. Even most African men celebrate the date you come into their life. They know how to celebrate surprise, give with gift, with friends, with they can spoil a woman. They know how to keep a date. Have African man celebrated your birthday before for you? Don't you see how sweet and interesting he make it become? How colorful he make your birthday? An African man will celebrate your birthday. An African man will celebrate. The, an African man would keep a date with you and celebrate your anniversary, wedding anniversary day. They will celebrate your kids' birthday. They will celebrate this. They know how to keep date. They know how to keep date. They know how to keep date. They celebrate your birthday. They celebrate your their wedding anniversary day. They celebrate and celebrate and celebrate and celebrate every moment with you. But if you are in the life of an African man, you will celebrate because you will only celebrate you. You are his ambassador because he always he always showcase you. He know how to sample his woman. He know how to showcase his woman. He know how to you know make you look on point. That he take care of you in such a way you look on point to the envy of other guys. You know, African man know how to do all that. All those sweet sweet things that make women or ladies to go crazy. All those sweet sweet things that a woman will be sleeping and be dreaming about, be thinking about and be smiling. You see a woman sleeping and smiling smiling for simply because she have an African man in her life you see her sleeping as she's smiling just the memory of the nice street that she got from an African man is always making her happy even when she's walking on the road even when she's walking and her busy moments she just remember one of those nice memories and she's smiling on her own an African man is my giver an African man is a spoiler they will spoil you and fill your memory with their and fill your brain with the memory of nice streets from them if you have not dated an african man you may miss you i swear <laughs> you are missing a lot just ask people who have an african man in their life how sweet loving and charming it is to be with an african man yeah for those of you who are not married to an african man don't be jealous so sorry don't come after me allow me to preach <laughs> Allow me to preach, allow me to speak what I know, allow me to tell the world the qualities of an African man. Yeah, if you are not married to an African man, you can actually share this video to your own partner to watch. Maybe she will, he will learn one or two nice tricks so that he will be able to be giving you, okay? If you are married to an African man, maybe, or you have an African, you are in a relationship with an African man, and he's not giving you all those vibes share this video to him actually so as for him to buckle up or if there is any reason or offense or any act of yours that is making him not to be unleashing all these irresistible acts or qualities to you yes he can actually tell you eh, you are the cause or this is happening or that will happen he can give you the reasons why he's not treating you nice because african men that i know these are the common thing commonest thing that they will do they know how to spoil the woman they know how to give you words affirmation they can call you pet names or manager like depending on their dialect african men know how to spoil you with petness african men know how to spoil you with gift african men will know how to spoil you with nice street african men know how to take care of you and take care of himself and also take care of his family and also take care of your own family you know even when he have not settled down with you a big man can pay your fees school fees can pay house rent for you can do so many things for you in order for you to be happy and that is why they hustle african man is not lazy so if you are in a relationship with an african man you need to be celebrating because african man is just a shadow he's going to protect you he's going to cover you he's going to care for you he's going to give you all that you need as a woman to be 
happy or to live a happy life and what you need to be doing for that your african man just pray for him always pray for him always pray our african ladies african women always pray for our man in the midnight we wake up we pray we pray in the morning we pray in the night we pray in the noon we pray with our season for our men for them to be all right for god to provide for them because if they are well to do if their pocket now but if their pocket is telling them the truth there's no how they will eat alone african man don't eat alone he will always share with the woman in his life so always pray for them for them to for God to favor them yes um, you can only complain you know when your African man is not having because when they don't have you see them you know behaving somehow they are not happy they are not they don't smile they are not happy they don't have they, they sit on these qualities because they know what they are supposed to do for you and they are not able to do it so they are not happy they are sad but if they are buoyant, if God, if God is favoring them, the atmosphere is favoring them, the universe is favoring them, you can never lack anything. So as a woman, pray for your African man day and night for God to favor them, for God to prosper them. Because if your African man is successful, if your African man is succeeding, you will be the next person to know. What, what is he going to eat? What is it? Like, you, he will be the best. He's eating. The enjoyment of that which he's eating is that you are there eating it with him. He believed that, you know, the, the enjoyment of it is when he's eating and you're eating. You know, so pray for your African man to be rich and wealthy. If your African man is successful in life, you will never regret it. Okay? So help him, give him the, any support, back him out spiritually with prayer, back, uh, support him, encourage him to uh, be successful. If he's successful, you will be successful because you are his ambassador, celebrating his life. He will always celebrate you and give you all these irresistible quality, charming qualities of an African man. All right. I love you guys. See you on my next video. Mm. Do where to subscribe, subscribe.